Hey there, everybody. P. Pardo here from Sea Tranquility. Happy Monday to you. Welcome to pick number seven of albums that are 10 years old in 2024. That's right. We're looking back on the year 2014, our favorite 15 albums that are celebrating their 10th birthdays and anniversaries this year. We split the month in half. The first half of the month, we looked at 2004. Now we're doing 2014. Today, for pick number seven, this is the... Uh, fourth studio album from this international band it was released January 27, 2014. Produced by the band for Metal Blade Radi and Radiant Records. I'm talking about Kaleidoscope by Transatlantic. It's a reason why they call them an international band, right? A transatlantic band, because of course you got guys from all over the place in this particular band. A super group of progressive rock. Of course, Neil Morse on keyboards. Acoustic guitars, lead and backing vocals. Neil, of course, Neil Morse band, Neil Morse solo, formerly of Spock's Beard, also of Flying Colors. Roy Nestalt, electric guitars, lead and backing vocals, percussion additional keys, of course, of the Flower Kings, formerly of Kaipa. Petra Wavis, bass guitar, lead and backing vocals, bass player for Marillion. And Mike Portnoy on drums, lead and backing vocals, of course, of Dream, formerly X of and now currently of Dream Theater again, also of Flying Colors, also of the Neil Morse Band, also of Winery Dogs and everything else that uh, Mike takes part in, right? So here we've got another big epic collection of tracks from transatlantic i don't know there are times this is my favorite transatlantic album and times it isn't it's it's you know it's hard for me with the transatlantic catalog it's like all all their albums are so big and bombastic and epic and all great um but i don't know re-listening to this one and getting ready for this episode i'm like man some sometimes some days man kaleidoscope yeah it's, it's really good right really good into the blue opens it up of course the five part 25 minute epic these guys do Half hour long epics like it's nobody's business. Uh, you know, big and bombastic, all sorts of different textures and layers of intensity in this track. You know, it's, everybody's singing here. It's followed up by Shine, another really cool, energetic prog rock track. Nice uh, kind of organ and guitar riff in there. Good vocal from Royna. Black as the Sky follows. You know, they get in the middle of the album. You have, you have the big two epics, which bookend the album, and then the stuff in the middle. Uh, Black as the Sky is so catchy might be one of the most hook-laden songs in their catalog. Uh, and a great vocal from Morse on this, really good. Beyond the Sun is up next, another really good track. And then, of course, the th just about 32-minute long Kaleidoscope title track, right? Seven parts. And again, you got the, the overture and then all the little bits and pieces, you know, Ride the Lightning and then the reprise at the end. Everything you want from Transatlantic, right? Big, long, extended instrumental passages, lots of bombast, more atmospheric, melodic sections, little bits of pop, little bits of heavy rock, lots of prog rock, right? Everything and anything in between that these guys can do, they do here. All the keyboard textures from Morse, Trovavis leathery bass playing, Portnoy doing his thing all over the place, very fine guitar playing from Roy Nestalt. Everybody's singing, it's just got everything, right? Uh, but you know, lots of memorable, memorable passages. Um, on this one. Charts. Austria at number 52. Belgium charts on the Flanders side, 83. On the Wallonia side, 59. Dutch charts number 6. Finland, 22. France, 77. Germany, 6. Sweden, 55. Swiss charts, 13. UK album charts, 52. US top hard rock albums. This is really a hard rock album. Number 14. Heat Seekers album number 3. And the independent music charts number 36. Also, if you get the, uh, if you got, I never got that, but if you get the uh, special edition, you get a bonus disc of all sorts of covers, right? You got a You and I by Yes, Can't Get It Out of My Head by ELO, Conquistador by Procol Harum, Goodbye Yellow Brick Road, Elton John, Tin Soldier by The Small Faces, Sylvia by Focus, Indiscipline by King Crimson, and Knights in White Satin from the Moody Blues, right? So uh, if, if the 75 minute long album itself wasn't enough, Go get the special edition. You get even more stuff. Some cool covers, right? So that is my pick for today. Kaleidoscope by Transatlantic. We got a picture of the superstars. Yes, we do. There they were. 
a decade ago. Mike's hair is a little less blue. Neil's got a little more hair. There they are. That's a good picture of them, I think. Yeah. You know, apparently their last album, that was going to be it, last album and tour. We'll see, right? We'll see. Never say never with these things, but they're, I think they pretty much have said that uh, that's it for Transatlantic. We've done all we can do over the last 25 years with this, and uh, we're going to kind of put it to rest because we've all got a million other things going on. But we'll see, right? We'll see. You know how some of these bands always do. They say, that, that's it, we're done. And then, you know, five years later, guess what? We didn't really mean it. We're back. So anyway, let us know what you think of Kaleidoscope down in the comments below as well as your pick for today. Pick number seven. We'll see you tomorrow for number six. Not a lot left, right? So we got just a few more before we move on to those great summertime albums. Great albums to listen to sitting by the pool, driving around in the car with the moonroof open, the top down, right? By the barbecue while you're playing volleyball out in the back, whatever it might be, right? Those, those great albums that get us in the mood for summertime. That's coming up start July 1st for that month. So uh, till then, visit us on the web at www.seatranquility.org. We're on Facebook, we're on YouTube, all together all the damn time. Please subscribe if you haven't already and click on that notification bell so you get alerted of all of our content as a post. And please hit the like button before you leave. Also down below, we got the links to our Ko-Fi page, our channel donations, our merch page, and our Cameo page. Thank you in advance for all your support there. We'll see you tonight on the Hudson Valley Squares. Till then, I am Pete Pardo. Have a good one, everybody. Bye-bye.